welcome students in this video we will try to complete our practical number 7 that is performing the data classification using the classification algorithm but uh, again this practical i will divide in two parts in the first video i will be showing you how to download and install the r because you will be practicing about this practical in r so first thing you have to go to uh, chrome here you can just uh, type a query that is rstudio.com so it come towards the rstudio you are installing the rstudio for the first time so you can just give a click on download studio once you go to download studio it asks you rstudio desktop download the studio here it asks you all installers you would like to download and install r first that is the step one so please give a click on download and install r here it asks you download and install R for what? Now we need to do it for Windows. So here you have to select download R for Windows. And installing the R for the first time. So give a click on this. So it asks you to download. Give a click on download now. So the R uh, language is being downloaded. We need to complete the installation of R first. And then we have to download the studio. So give a click on this. Download whatever has been done by you. So I just get app from the store or change my app recommendation. I just change my app recommendation. It is not only from Microsoft store. It is from anywhere. Okay. And uh, now I just again go towards download. Run this particular R language. So it asks you R for Windows setup. Fine. Complete the setup. It is a very quite a quick setup. Give a click on next. 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 Uh, please specify yes or no. Click on next. So no accepts default. It's better to go for what uh, accept default. Give a click on next. To continue, click on next. You would like to refer to different folder. I just said it be the same folder. Give a click on next. Next. And this is how it completes the installation of R for Windows. Okay. Once the installation of R for Windows has been completed, then we require to go to the second step. That is installing the R Studio. So give a click on download the R Studio for Windows. So till the time the installation is getting completed, let's well download the R Studio. So here it comes. The R is being completing the installation. Great. Finish. Now it asked me for R Studio. R Studio is also getting downloaded properly. So once it being downloaded properly, then give a click on it. It will start the installation of the R Studio. Yes. The first R language and then installation of the R Studio. Give a click on next. Next. Install. It will hardly take another three, four minutes of us to complete the installation of R Studio. But if suppose your setup is appropriate, then it is very easy to complete our practicals in time and properly. Otherwise, what happens many times the students are not completing the setup properly. And uh, um, then they stack up anywhere. So I uh, advise first you complete the installation of R, then you complete the installation of R Studio. This will hardly maximum take will take some three to four minutes for you for completing both the installation depending on the internet speed and your machine performance also. So once this has been completed, then we need to check whether the R Studio has been properly installed or not. So I will be showing you how to check whether our R Studio has been properly installed or not. So once that has been cleared, then in the next video, it is possible for us to go for completing our practical. So I give a click on finish. Now you give a click on start and select over here the option called as R Studio. The first option only will be displayed to you. Once you give a click on start, it is recently added R Studio. Right? So this is what our R Studio is. Uh, let's see how exactly it looks. So use your machine's default 64 version for R. Yes, it is being proper because we had installed it. And then give a click on OK. So this is how the R Studio looks like, which has your menu bar, which has your toolbar, which has the console. It asks you, may we upload the crash report? So R Studio automatically, if you say yes, that is also OK. If you say no, it is also OK. I am not interested in going for it. So fine, this is how the R Studio looks like. So you must be ready with our R and R Studio before we are starting with the practical number 7, 8, 9, 10, all practicals, you will be doing it using the R. 
So please install the R and install the R Studio. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Be tuned with us for the next video.